sit at home shouldn't be in Southeast. Let him do sit at home in Abuja. Sit at home in Kano. Sit at home in, 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 in Lagos. Sit at home in Ondo. Sit at home in uh, Nasarawa. All over the country. Are you understanding me? Sit at home at Dawa. What's up, my people? I greet you now. It's your boy, Italian David. I didn't say we met now. I didn't know with this, my daddy. Now, like, in one or two things now, when he won't tell us. Obi, yo, badass, daddy. Yeah, uh, the issue is that I don't think that is the best because of the suffering of the people. You know, many people, they go to work every day to earn a living. And if they do not go, definitely they can't earn a living. So it tells hard on the people. Uh, so I don't think that is the best. There are so many other ways he can even do it. I strongly believe, but I'm not in a position to start giving him ideas on what to do. You understand? And moreover, the people that are mostly affected are the, not only the large Biafra, but just few Biafrans, which are the Southeast. If he has carried the, the crusade to other part of Biafra, like Akwaibom, Cross River, Delta, Benue, I mean, part of Benue anyway, um, part of Kogi, then Rivers and Bayesa. Uh -huh. Now we should say okay. But no, it jo it's just some few people paying a very serious and huge price. It's not the best. Okay, so like, you don't see and say like, um, in they try to do all this thing because of the I know, I know. Of yes, I know, I know. You understand? But if he goes against against those holding Mazinam the Kano, that would be better. <laughs> do you understand me? Like how you think say if they go against those yeah, people now? Sit at home shouldn't be because uh, uh, sit at home shouldn't be in Southeast. Let him do sit at home in Abuja. Sit at home in Kano. Sit at home in, 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 in Lagos. Sit at home in Ondo. Sit at home in uh, Nasarawa. All over the country. Are you understanding me? Sit at home at Daura. As simple as ABC. So if he cannot do it, fine. Then let him allow people, poor people to attend to there. Because uh, uh, those people are innocent. So those people are innocent. It's just, you know, punishing and impoverishing the people. So I don't think it's, uh, it's a good idea. The people are suffering. If it's only that Monday, fine. People can endure. But now, making it a stretch of one week, no. A lot of families are there. I remember one man, in, uh, maybe in Wari or so, in Delta State, uh, during the COVID. The husband or the, or the wife or something, I think the kid was sick. He went to buy gare or buy medicine with KK. The police saw, shot him and killed him during the COVID, you know? So all this kind of thing, uh, things we, our people has to check and reason again. So, okay, you know what I'm saying? At least by this time now, the, like, uh, the federal government of Nigeria is supposed to release a mass in the car, no? Yes, of course. That one is uh, basically that the government are not doing the right thing. The government of Nigeria, they never, they don't obey any law. They are, they, in fact, everything concerning Nigeria is calm. You understand? Everything. The election is calm. Everybody saw it. <laughs> you understand? It was a mess. The appointments are a mess. Everything concerning that country, people do as they want. So, and that is why a lot of people have left even the country. The police, you see, they kill anyhow. The NDLA, they shot a two-year-old boy and killed the boy in Asaba. What concerns a little boy with NDA come, NDLA come? They are, the Nigerian security are trigger happy. Which is not the best. It's quite a pity. So, sir, like uh, you know, are you still supporting the division of Nigeria? To me, um, division of Nigeria, if it's well done, fine. But I see a lot of people in the north going to suffer, and that is why. Nigeria, in the first instance, was a merge. The Southern and Northern Protectorate were merged. 
the reason was that the North cannot stand on themselves economically. Are you understanding me? Excuse now, me. not that because you check out the main poverty is in the North. But the North has what it takes to feed even the entire Africa. But because those leaders that has been there are from the North and they are corrupt. They don't want their own people even to come out from cage. That is the simple truth. So that their people will be coming and say, Babi Allah, Babi Allah. That is the simple truth. And they had to see an Igbo man who doesn't want to, you know, who wants to struggle on his own, on his own and make ends meet. That is the nature of an Igbo man. Igbo man gives you respect based on age. Igbo man do not respect you because you are wealthy. He can only respect you when he, you put food on his table. Not even that, but when you call, say, hey, boy, come, come and do this. That is, you see the difference, the way the Igbo's risen and the world has risen.